Hey guys, welcome to Fallout 4, episode 170. So, I hope you guys enjoy it. Uh, like, subscribe, and comment, that would really help me out. Now, I did change my name on my YouTube channel. It is Anthony Giacobbe dash where um, under dash where the dash is on the basically bottom and capital YT um, gaming reason why I did that is because it was easier for people to find me because there are so many Anthony's come to find out I want people to be able to find me real quick so just to let you guys know, if you're wondering and always wanted to figure out what your son becomes, here's a little hint. When you go over to Sean's crib, I'm coming, buddy. Look down. There's an F. Why is there an F? And then there's a P. There's you know, that, that don't mean anything. So what does F mean? Well, if you guys didn't watch my other playthrough, I won't um, spoil it, but it does mean something later on in the game. I will explain it later on, so I will keep that there, and later on in the game, I will explain it. Now, come over here in the corner. You'll see a book pointing, like, I guess hiding from the nuclear bombs uh, when you first watched the first episode it was up on this thing right here but now it's not so crouch down grab that and you can do strength um, purposation um, endurance charisma or intelligence or agility or luck so I'm gonna do strength because I can, because that would help me out. Now, um, I wanted to show you those two things there. I did empty out my inventory last episode, and I do have the cryolator. If you guys want to see on how to get that, check out my episode 169 of this of Fallout 4 and my Fallout 4 playlist. Um, I have my Fallout 4 playlist, I have my Nuka World playlist, DLC playlist, and I also have a Vault 81 playlist and a not a Nukatron playlist yet. So I didn't do that, I don't think. <clears throat> so, I apologize if I just coughed. Um, we're not going to go to Conquer just yet, or... with them just yet. Did dog meat kill him? No. These, um, do I have a handgun? Yeah, I do. Got him. And I just got to conquer. So, um, we don't have to do this mission. You know, people sometimes just, um, you know, skip conquered all together when they're doing their Brotherhood playthrough because, um, of the raiders here. Got 
Got him. Her. Got someone. So, we're gonna grab our shotgun. gonna kind of do a Minutemen playthrough for a tad bit because uh, just to level up um, so let's actually we'll do this right now charisma we're gonna keep on doing our charisma until it's fully maxed out now Let's save. Put some armor on. Farmer clothes. Okay, then go over to your weapons. Um, where is it? Short laser musket, so favorite that. I'm gonna put it right at the security beacon. I mean, uh, basically security baton, sorry. Optional, take the laser musket, but we did. We forgot to reload it, oops. Picking skill, but we don't have that. So, nothing there now. What do you think? Jumping in shadows. Yeah, you're probably right. Gotta cut down on the jet, I guess. <laughs> oh no, I only have one shell left. Time to reel them in. gonna take everything and then when we get back to our I guess settlement we'll go through it I'm coming in there and we're gonna skin every last one of you come on and they ain't going nowhere we got other shit to deal with you hear that I gotta take a little walk I'm back get back, get back. Come on. 
Okay. Man, don't forget I don't know to who grab you are, but that time is there we go. This with a free hollow tape. Impeccable. Preston Garvey, Commonwealth Minuteman. Huh. Ah, uh, that ain't it. Um. Glad to, glad to help. help. Well, if that's true, we could use some more goodwill. As you can God see, we're in a bit of a mess here. Go on. Please, go on. A month ago, there were 20 of us. Yesterday, there were eight. Now we're five. First, it was the ghouls in Lexington, and now this mess. Uh, sounds rough. Sorry. Sounds rough. God damn it. Thanks. Good to meet someone who really cares. Anyway, we figured Concord would be a safe place to settle. Those uh, raiders proved ain't. us wrong. But, well, we do have one idea. Better be good. Better be a good one. Sturgis, tell him. There's a crash vertebrate up on the roof. Old school. Pre-war. You might have seen it. Well... Looks like one of its passengers left behind a seriously sweet goodie. We're talking a full suit of cherry T-45 power armor. Military issue. I like it. I like it. <laughs> yeah, I thought you might. Protection with an added bonus. Get the suit. You can rip the minigun right off the vertebrate. Do that, and those raiders get an express ticket to hell. You dig? Um, might work. <clears throat> Could work. It'll work, provided we can reactivate the suit. It's totally out of juice. Probably has been for a hundred years. It can be powered up again. But we're a bit stuck. Um, solution? So, what's the solution? What you'll need is an old pre-war FC. A standardized fusion core. Your high-grade, long-term nuclear battery used by the military and some companies way back when. And we know right where to find one. But we can't get to the damn thing. It's down in the basement, locked behind a security gate. Look, I fix stuff. I tinker. Bypassing security ain't exactly my forte. You could give it a shot. Yes. Can't be too hard. I'll see what I can do. Well, all right. Maybe our luck's finally turning around. Once you jack the core into the power armor and grab that minigun, those raiders will know they picked the wrong fight. Good luck. Wow, this is the first time it, uh, him talking that didn't uh, mess up him talking. Because I had a weird glitch in my game in the beginning where it'd um, be hard to do, so... If I only had a bobby pin. Alrighty, let's do this. Okay, unlock security gate. Unlock. Oh, it should have unlocked. Unlock. Open it. Grab the fusion core. Run up the set of stairs, just guys, to let you know. When you come in, there is a bag of concrete that will always respawn, so you can come here uh, a whole bunch of times, I think every couple of days, and it will fix it. So let's run all the way back up the stairs, the way we came. I am out of AP, so I'll walk the rest of the way. There is a bubble head here. Yes, we need help. Can you get a ball coming? What are you going to do in that stupid jumpsuit? Going to death? Alrighty, guys. See you guys on the next other side. Alrighty. Just to guys let you know, come over here. And listen to this hollow tape. Personal log. United States Army Staff Sergeant Michael Daly. 
Bottle cap stash? This past Saturday, October 23rd, while en route to West Stockbridge, a vertebrate crashed into the roof of this museum. The cause? EMP following nuclear detonation. Several, in fact. From the intel I've gathered, this was a global event. The co-pilot was killed on impact. The pilot died of his injuries a day later. The day after that, Flaherty and Kanawa were shot by some scared, desperate survivors. Then Brzezinski took off running. Haven't seen him since. Now, it's my turn to go AWOL, if that concept even applies anymore. My armor's fusion core is burned out, so I guess my soldiering days are done. I'm heading to Boston, on foot, to see if my sister survived all this. She's got an apartment on Boylston Street. This is Mike Daly, signing out. Good luck, and God bless America, or what's left of it. Alrighty guys, now, I'm going to show you the other holotape that, um, Codsworth gave us. So, oops, wrong area, go into miscellaneous, go to Hi Honey. Oopsie, <laughs> no, 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 fingers away. There we go. Sean and I need to tell you how great of a father you are. But we're going to anyway. Isn't that right? You are kind and loving. <laughs> Funny. That's right. And patient. So patient. Patience of a saint, my mom used to say. Look, with Sean and us all being home together, it's been an amazing year. But even so, I know our best days are yet to come. Mm, there'll be changes, sure. Things we need to adjust to. You'll rejoin the civilian workforce, and I'll shake the dust off my law degree. But everything we do, no matter how hard, we do it for our family. Now, say goodbye, Sean. Bye-bye. Say bye bye. Come on. <laughs> bye, honey. We love you. That is the last time you'll hear Nora's voice. Or the wife's voice. If you're doing this as a role play kind of deal. Hold on, guys. Alrighty, let's do this. Grab the vertebrate minigun. Grab it. Up here. Boss, we got somebody up here. Why don't you get down here? Show me that fancy gun up close. Not a lot of people can get past Give me that! Come on, I got places to be! Hey, guys! Come here! Don't forget... Don't forget to get... The Corvega storage key from Gristle. If you guys don't do it, when you guys get to... Oh. Come 
Thanks for the death call me. Thanks for all the armor too and weapons. So I would collect a whole bunch of weapons so you guys can um, have scrap weapons that you can use for um, other weapon modifications because I find that very useful. So let's go back up there and talk to them. That was a pretty amazing display. I'm just glad you're on our side. Uh, we're not friends. I'm on your side. Let's do everyone okay. You guys gonna be okay now? Yeah, for a while anyway. We can at least move someplace. Listen, when we first met, you said you were glad to help. Well, you did. And we owe you our lives. So here, yeah. it ain't much, but it's the best way I can say thank you. 50 fusion cells and 100 caps. Um, let's do, I'll take it. I'll take what I can get. <laughs> Spoken like a true merc. Well, if you ever feel like fighting for something other than yourself, you should meet up with us in Sanctuary. I could use someone like you. Someone who can get things done. Um, maybe. I'll think about it. Before you leave, kid, a word about the journey you're about to start on. Because I seen your destiny, and I know your pain. Um, going on? Okay, I'm listening. You're a man out of time, out of hope. All's not lost. I can feel your son's energy. He's alive. Um, I'm listening. I'm listening. Look, kid, I know how I sound. The sight, it's weird. And it ain't always clear. But your son's out there. And even I don't need the sight to tell you where you should start looking. The great green jewel of the Commonwealth, Diamond City, the biggest settlement around. I need more. Please, Mama Murphy, I'm working for nothing. I need more. Look, kid, I'm tired now. Maybe you'll bring me some chems later. The sight will paint a clearer picture. No. Mama Murphy, we talked about this. That junk. It's gonna kill you. Ah, oh, shush, Preston. We're all gonna die eventually. We're gonna need the sight. And our new friend here, he's gonna need it too. Now let's get going. Sanctuary awaits. All right, folks. Thanks to our friend here, it's safe to move out. We're heading for that place Mama Murphy knows about. Sanctuary. It's not far. She knows about it? You mean she had one of her visions while she was stoned out of her guard? And now you want us to just head out on another wild goose chase based on no better plan than Mama Murphy saw it? It can hold, hold, hold on, hold on. Than... Everybody just take it easy. We're all in this together, right? So Marcy, you got a better idea of what we should do next? Anybody? Well then, sanctuary it is. Let's just hope it lives up to its name. Come on, June. It's time to go. Oh, okay. Now, we're going to follow them all the way to Sanctuary. So, I'm going to go speed this up. You guys watch me multiple times. Oh, Hold on to that power armor now. The city is where you Big need to head. Rust. Sturgis. No, I want to get out of here. Thank you. No? Everyone's going so fast, I can't get out. Thank you. Don't 
forget the price we paid to get this bar. Hi. Let's move out. I'll take point. Stay close, everyone. Sounds right like you better boss. get going to Diamond City. If you guys remember the hole that um, the death claw came through, so come down into the hole, go all the way down, go into the Concord Clinic door for access. Alrighty, so, um, get on down here, let's grab our baton, let's unchain this door, we might need to go use it later. Now there will be, you know, stuff that you can grab here. So definitely grab as much stuff as you can here. Dogmeat is a really good companion in the beginning. He does mess up your stealth every once in a while, but it's okay by me. So we're going to go and stay down. So, grab everything that this raider had, jump onto this, um, these two cinder blocks, jump up again, jump up onto this corner, oops, come on, jump up on the corner, once you get it, don't need to do it in power armor, I know that, so... Hold on guys while I get up there, but this is the same way you will be doing it. Okay, got it up, got up there. Now there'll be some jet. It's usually a fusion core here. Day tripper. One of the rarest chems in the game. Now we'll go up a set of stairs here. Go up this way. I know there's fusion core in here. In this area. It's right away. That's a good thing. Especially on a low level. Sugar bombs. That's how to go down. The other one went this way. I know there's a fusion core somewhere. Alien toy. 
purified water. Alrighty guys, hold on. We're at the radar body, so if you turn around from the radar body, walk straight, you'll see where he was sleeping. And if you take a look at this terminal, look exactly right, you'll see the pipes. Look at the pipes, and right here next to this steamer trunk is a tattoo um, book. Excellent. So grab this, permanently unlock a new uh, Quizzent facial tattoo. Now, I'm still looking for that fusion core because I'm about out. I'm right where we uh, killed the rad roaches. This is the end of the episode because my armor is about to die. Um, that's going to be a big issue, especially, you know, not having any fusion cores. So. This will be the end of the episode. Thank you so much for watching. Like, subscribe, and comment to really help me out, especially subscribing. I've recently hit 36 subscribers, so thank you so much to all 36 of you. And to the people that are actually subscribing right now or whenever, thank you so much. Alrighty, guys, this will be the end of the episode right now. Thank you so much. Have a great day. Peace.